Hello! Okay. Things are a little different here. I'm using Streamlabs for the first time. They finally made Streamlabs accessible to people on Mac. So I'm gonna test it out for a little while. It means that I can have a little something like, uh, I can have widgets. I can do this now. Check one, two, check. Okay, there we go. Why did my mic go out? That was weird. Okay. I guess I gotta keep an eye on that, because I, I it just... Okay. That's frustrating. I'm only, like, giving, giving Streamlabs a shot right now, because it's something that I didn't previously have access to, but if it, if it gives me crap like that, I ain't gonna stick around with it, you know? Why would I? Egg cup. Egg Cup, I like Egg Cup a lot because it has some of the more fun ones. We got, uh, we got Mute City, which is great. We got, uh, Excite Bike Arena, which I like a lot. Yoshi Circuit, I can, uh, I'm not big on Yoshi Circuit, if just because, yeah, it's got all the weird lumps because it's Yoshi shaped. It's not terrible. I like it. I just, uh, just wish it was better, you know? It's just kind of hard to drive. All right, uh, here we go. Ooh, I'm a little rusty. It's been a couple days. There we go. Now let's zip out. Whoops, right off the side. That's good. That's a good start. As pro strats, right there. You fall. You fall off the side so that you're not in first, and then you can't get blue shelled. You know. That's the, that's the trick. You never want to be in first, because first place gets blue shelled. You always want to be in, like, fifth. Fifth is the fifth is safe. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. I got a red shell. Red shell's pretty solid. So if I just hang back here, my red shell. Whoa, whoa. Ah! Buggery, dude. Not happy with that one. All right, all right. Yeah, the big things with this Streamlabs, other than uh, the widget that shows... Whoa, ah, crap. The widget that shows uh, on stream when people follow uh, is that it has chat built in, so I don't have to use my phone anymore. That's nice. Whether or not I'll stick with it, we'll see. We'll see in the future. But as of right now, give it a shot. I think it's all right. Uh, it seems like it uses up a lot less CPU than standard OBS. So that's that's nice. Um, what else? Oh yeah, they finally uh, the Genki Shadowcast Kickstarter finished. So they collected the pledge, and they're saying they're going to have them shipped out by April, hopefully. They were real gutsy about it. They were just like, yeah, we, we started uh, production in mid-December, actually, because we were so sure we were going to get this, and we wanted to get it to you guys in time. And it's like, that's, I mean, not the best business decision, since they had to pay out of pocket, and there was a chance they weren't going to get it, but it worked out. So, I don't know. Shows what I know, you know? But, uh, yeah. I, I hope to get that, because all it does is basically turn 
an HDMI output off of a game console into a webcam input for your computer. And that would be great. That's exactly what I need here. You know? That would mean no lag, no more audio issues. I'm stoked. I hope it I hope it works out correctly. And that's how you get in first. Professional. Not professional. I don't get paid for this. I like to, but yeah. It's difficult. So anyways, between uh No leg. Or are you making a joke since you spelt it like that? I don't know. There is a little bit of lag. If I was humming along to the music, you'd be able to notice it pretty quick. Um, but yeah, oh, that that should be good. And it's only like 40 bucks, so like, hopefully that's the price they actually sell it at after that. Oh boy, this weekend, so I am doing that tabletop game jam, so, you know, I'll be a little busy with that, but I'll still be taking the time. We're gonna do another stream of Oath on Saturday. Which, it'll only be four player this time, so probably like eh, three hours max, you know? But I hope y'all tune into that. That'd be fun. And, yeah, I'm pretty sure you're already following one. But uh, I am at 49 followers now, so someone gets to be gets to be the 50th follower. It's exciting. Oh. Right, right, because I it's part of, it's my accent. My accent is, uh, uh, what was it? Some Somebody told me it's Cascadian because I'm from the very northern Washington state. So it's effectively the most Canadian. It's like a very Canadian-esque accent. And yeah, stuff like leg, um, sag, bag. That's how I say it. I, I get, it gets me into trouble when I'm with clients. I actually had that recently. Um, they, they were talking about, what was it, Digital Dragon? And so I called it Digital Dragon. And they were like, you, s you said it weird, could you say it, say it right? And I was like, what, oh, you want Digital Dragon. And it doesn't feel right, still, still never feels right. Gotta get a grocery bag. Ugh, weird. Yeah, see, it's like, I, I, it's just like a thing. The thing I figured out is it kind of depends on what sort of an accent your family has. Um, my family is very Slavic and, like, European. So a lot of those languages say it like that, like bagel. Um, meanwhile, people, people I've met who have Spanish-speaking parents, or uh, <coughs> parents from, like, Mexico, whatever. We'll say bag, I guess. I don't know. That's my best thing. Minnesota. Minnesota will do it. Philippines, I'm not as sure. They got Tagalog, which is kind of Spanish-sounding a little bit. I, I believe it's because it was colonized by Spain. Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> All right. Two. When I said two there, that's when the two show up on the screen. So hopefully that'll give you some idea of the not very, not very like extreme lag. But when I'm playing something like Pokemon and I react to whether or not I caught something before it shows up on screen, it can be kind of, uh, people don't like that. That part, I can never get, get that part quite down. In this particular one, it's just such a tight turn after another tight turn. I can't, I can't manage, you know? At least not yet. I just need more practice. This is my first time playing this one at 150cc. Oh, God damn it! Fucking shells! I need to use my shell. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. I mean, yeah, it's just an accent thing. Like, everybody has some kind of accent, and it's one of the things that makes us most unique as people. Because you're always going to pick up uh, a thing or two. You know? Sometimes people try and force accents, and it sounds kind of silly. I, I, I have to study them quite a bit for work. Because in voice acting, sometimes you got to do a different accent. Sometimes you do it for fun, like, I mean, in my Pokemon playthrough, since it's all supposed to be sort of the UK, I've been doing a bit of that. Um, mostly Scottish, but who's counting? I was for a bit. I do still plan to 100% the decks, it's just like, to do the Champion Cup. To do the Champion Cup is gonna be a lot of voice acting and I gotta pick a time when I'm like my voice is up to snuff yeah exactly I mean a lot of people like the the silly accents oh, that's the thing too accents are fun to do but then sometimes they can be a little like, if you don't do it spot on, or is it being respectful? I don't know. It's not really... Not really my... I'm not a linguist. I just I just read whether people write for me. Ah, damn it. Am I going to be able to get this on the first try? I don't want to jinx it, but... I've actually been doing quite well. I'm fairly certain I got first place in those last two last two races. I didn't even think about it when I at Sight Bite because that's the one that I've played the most. I, I tried to get the time trial world record on it, but I, I'm, I'm still like a couple seconds shy. Ah, damn it! Ah, but we... I mean, shoot, if I could get one, like, first try here and then just get into a second one in the single-hour stream I'm doing here, that'd be pretty sick. Do, 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 do. Whoa. Oh boy. I will read your... Oh, I will certainly read your comment after I'm done racing here, but it's a lot to read at the moment. I appreciate your enthusiasm, though. It is most appreciated. Whoa, whoa. We're getting there. We're getting there. No! Ah, fucker. Oh, slim pickings. Now, what in the wide, wide world of sports is this? What, what, what? Fifth, fifth on lap three ain't easy, but I've done it before. Especially everybody's pretty tight, tight in here. I'm running out of I'm running out of space. It's gonna get close. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, I think it's too late. Yeah. Ah, oh, Ludwig, Ludwig! Oh, wait, wait, wait! Can I? Second. You know you got a point there, one. 
Yeah, I get. I mean, I guess it comes down to the person. Um, I mean, you can still do harm to somebody without like necessarily intending to, much in the same way that they can be harmed without necessarily taking offense to it. But that's that's a whole esoteric thing, and I don't want to be. I don't want to get into that. At least not right now, you know. I just took some melatonin and CBD. I'm very relaxed. I don't. I don't. Do not have the current mind to discuss intersectional social justice. I'm just going to play this game as a little Koopa man. Leaf tires. Hmm. How's that compare? A little better on the acceleration. I'm gonna stick with the GLA. Yeah, this is nice though. I can see just the chat over on the screen. So I don't have to uh, be looking down at my phone or whatever. Although having the phone up to here for the uh, racing game is actually pretty helpful. So I might still do that. I don't know. I don't know. The Great Lakes Avengers. Oh, man. Finding about those was equivalent to when I found out there was a Captain Canada. That, that still tickles me. Oh, so, so many, so many silly heroes. Or like, listen, it's still like pretty good and all that. But reading like the Infinity War comics and just like Thanos is so, so silly in those comics. And I mean, it's just the whole thing is literally him just simping for Lady Death. And I don't like to... Oh, Technically, I'm not allowed to say that. I forgot. Apologies. That is that is a banned word now. Um, but it's just him like trying to impress Lady Death the whole time, and friggin' Mephistopheles just being being the butthead the whole time. Is that what he's called? No, there's a Captain Canada. He hung out with friggin' Wolverine, right? I swear, maybe I'm wrong. He's like, he has the big old maple leaf on his like suit and his suit's mostly just spandex. Yeah, I'm like really positive there's a Captain Canada. I'd say, I mean, I'd say look it up, I guess. I could be wrong. I've only, I only saw him in the one comic, but like, it, it really struck me as, like, silly, so. That's Guardian? Hmm. I swear, I remember the words Captain Canada being in front of my eyes at some point. Maybe it was, like, a... I don't know, maybe it was, like, a parody. Something. People are always goofing on, on Marvel. As well they should. It's a multi-million, billion dollar company. But, you know, whatever. So, you guys, you guys hear about the, uh, the whole GameStop situation? I don't, I don't care. So everybody's been going off about that at me lately. And it's like, it's just stock market garbage. It's the same thing that the stock market always does. Yeah, Mephisto. What? mephisto Ophelis. Same thing. Like, you can't. That's, that's half of the name I said. And yeah, maybe I was thinking about cats, but also, maybe you should think about cats. You ever just? 
All right, here we go. See, I feel pretty confident on this one. I have no idea how I'm gonna do. I have no idea how I'm gonna do on the third one, the dragon one, I barely got through last time. So that's what mainly why I was hoping I could get it first try. So I'm gonna have to fumble in that business again. Come on, come on. Don't think you can get too far ahead of me now, Ludwig. Ludwig von Drake. Oh, wow. These green shells. Oh my god, the sideways video on cats was so good. I just, it's, it sucks. Like, I mean, he goes off about how Tom Hooper is just a terrible, terrible filmmaker. But I think the thing that really frustrates me about it is Tom Hooper is the only person currently making movie adaptations of Broadway musicals. And he gets great stars who can put in amazing performances and stuff. But he's just so bad at adapting those 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 shows. He's just so bad at it. Like, I'm sure... <laughs> Sideways is probably good with long videos now, but like... I, I really want to hear what he has to say about Into the Woods, because that was a travesty. Like, Cats? Cats was really bad. And most people recognized it because the effects were so bad. But, like, Into the Woods is so poorly done. Friggin' J James Corden is a blight on any musical film. He's so bad. He's so unfunny. He's so untalented. He's not a great singer. Just, like... He's one of those comedians where he's, like, he is fat. And, like, all of his humor comes about him just, like, committing to doing stuff that, haha, a fat person's doing it. But it's, like, it's not really funny. I'm not... Am I offended? I don't know. I'm just annoyed. I just don't like... I just don't like him. He's, he's a hack. I don't even remember the giant lake. I don't even remember if I finished Into the Woods. I was so upset from the beginning. Uh, the Johnny Depp is the wolf was like completely missed the point there's just so much so much that could have been done great with that but like all of his stuff is just weirdly dreary like everybody gives friggin uh Tim Burton crap for being like dark and dreary and stuff but like Tom Hooper also has the aesthetic but it doesn't feel intentional it feels like he just doesn't know how to use colors like, he just, he thinks his color grade is okay, when in reality it's just super drab and boring. Oh, motherfucker. Villager! Villager! Get the fuck out of here, Cat Peach. Whose cat are you? Fine, I can get back up to first. My build is very good now. Motherfuckers. Ha! Ah! 
Oh my fucking god. Whoa, I'm gonna freaking uh villager! Get fucked! Oh my god! Right at the freaking end. Whew. Oh, I would totally recommend um one that uh if you can track it down not exactly legitimately, but similar to like cats and Sweeney Todd, there was in the nineties a uh a VHS release of the original Broadway cast. I'm pretty sure the original Broadway cast. They still have Bernadette Peters as the witch and everything. Of Into the Woods. So I'd recommend getting it. And and watching that. Uh, the Sweeney Todd is also pretty good. Because, I mean, Sweeney Todd is just... It's Sondheim, man. He's amazing. Uh, but yeah, that's how I originally saw it. When I was in drama class in high school. Uh, they... We got the auditorium for performances and stuff and we just watched all of Into the Woods and it was yeah it's really good Bernadette Peters is great now I do take umbrage with the fact that people say it's it's what brought hip hop to Hollywood or not Hollywood hip hop to Broadway cause like yeah okay I guess you can technically consider the the greens um, bit from the opening to be like a a rap, but I don't know. I don't know if I'd really personally classify it as that. But then we get into like the, the sideways had a video about this, and it was kind of controversial because it got into issues of race and stuff um, and cultural appropriation, but. He talked about what is the difference between rap and spoken word. Oh no, rent sucks. I mean, even the movie, the movie is very poorly done, but it d doesn't really save a show that is already pretty crap. I know, I also don't like Wicked very much. Like, it's saying that you don't like rent around drama people, and especially LGBT plus drama people, uh, is like, that's sacrilege. They will lose their minds at you. And it's like, yes, it was important representation, and I appreciate that, and I appreciate that, uh, the most likable character is a trans character. That's awesome. But also, they're all really bad people. And, like, they're, more than being bad people, they're really unpleasant people to watch. It's not a fun time watching them be, like, so garbage. Whoa, whoa, oh, I made it, yes! No Link, no! But yeah, I just, Rent is bad for so many reasons. Uh, what was... I don't know, I guess, like... I've never been super blown away by anything Adina Menzel's done. I like Frozen. The music to that's pretty good. But, yeah, Wicked, not a fan. I guess Popular's fun. Um, And Loathing. If that's from that one. It, I might be thinking of a different show. Uh, but, yeah, I don't, I don't know. The rent is pretty bad. The, I don't know if I'd necessarily say, uh, in Team America World Police at the beginning, they have the, uh, the parody of Rent with the song Everybody Everyone Has AIDS. Like I kinda get it, and like musically that is very similar to Rent. Um 
And like the main point is just showing how like really up their own ass Hollywood is and like acting in general. Uh, but that show, like, I mean, it's the main impetus of the plot or the main main thing that starts the plot, but it's like not actually that. Uh, it's not really that like shoved in your face, honestly. I did, I got, um, I got Coco to watch Book of Mormon recently, which was awesome. Because Book of Mormon is, like, my favorite musical? Yeah, it's definitely, like, well, favorite musical. I'd say probably How to Get Ahead in Business Without Really Trying is favorite, but, like, Book of Mormon is, like, right up there with it. <coughs> So, yeah, we watched that. They really liked it, which is cool. Um, yeah, and it's just, it got me thinking about those songs. Thinking about those songs again. Also thinking about the various different versions, you know? Um, you're mainly in it for Josh Gad. I just, I love uh, Elder Cunningham so much as a character, and then, uh, yeah, Josh Gad played him really well. I haven't actually seen anybody else's performance of him. I have one. I don't know, may it could be better. Josh Gad is just spectacular, though. Josh Gad is, like, any t role James Corden gets, it feels like it was stolen from Josh Gad. Every time, it's like, it would have been improved if they had Josh Gad in that role. But no. Mm. Had to be James. Always. Always James Corden. Honestly, my voice is starting to go a little bit. And, uh, so I'm gonna finish up this specific run. Fingers crossed I actually get the cup. And then I think I'm gonna end the stream. I just wanted to do a quick one. So, that might be very quick. But at the same time, that's not, you know. It's my stream, whatever. I don't know. Transformer named Corden. What uh, what does Corden the Transformer transform into? Because I remember I had one that transformed into a shark. Uh, I had a Beast Wars one that turned into an eagle and a bear and also an eagle bear. Something. Or was it? I think it might have just been the... No, I'm confusing it. I had like a Digimon one. That was, like, the worm guy and the blue guy from, like, the second generation. Uh, it was, like, you could make it one of the, their champion forms, then the other one's champion form, and then their, like, fusion digivolve, which was really cool. I also, as a kid, got the Digimon card game and never once played it. I have no idea if it was even any good. I, I literally, I think I read the rules, and yeah, nobody, my little brothers were too young, uh, my older sibling was not interested, which, fair. I think my dad tried to humor me, but I couldn't explain the rules very m well, and he didn't want to read them. Lamborghini cop car, ew. Cops. Um... Although that makes me think Lamborghini. Oh, okay. But uh yeah, I that makes me remember Lamborghini Automobili. Or Automobili Lamborghini. It's um it was a racing game where you only drove Lamborghinis. 
Uh, for the Nintendo 64, that was like my OG racing game. I played the crap out of that. That and like Mario Kart 64. I gotta play that on stream sometime. It's not very long. I remember it didn't have actually very much going on. But, you know. You know. Yeah, my voice is really going. I got a lot of work this week, which feels good. I got, uh, I got 29 orders, which is pretty good. Getting, it definitely made up for the pretty lax, like half a month before that. That's, that's the thing though, is when you freelance, you kind of have to measure things out week by week, month by month. You can't just think of things as like, I didn't make any money today. It's like, just relax. Do something to get your name out there. And work on something, something like this. Streaming, streaming. Streaming has not gotten me any clients yet, but I, I would not be shocked if at some point I could because I like, I have my website, my like kinda, kinda crapo website, if I'm being honest, uh, that's, that that's gotten me work. I've, that I've gotten like, multiple, uh, yeah, m multiple jobs from that. Or like YouTube videos, I've heard, gotten people who like see my YouTube and they're like, oh, hey, can you, can you do this? And I'm like, sure. I have one dude who asked if I could do a Bart Simpson impression. I cannot. For anybody curious. Um, I let him know that Bart Simpson is uh, played by a female voice actor. So he might want to check into that. And he, he was surprised. So I guess it, it was good of me to clue him in. Oh boy. Oh man, my thumb's starting to go a little numb. I'm, I'm clenched. Tightened up. This is fine. It's very close. Closely packed. Okay, okay, nearly. Yes, the end is right here. I always think it's back there. No, no, ah. It's fine, I'll, I'll, I'll play Mute City and then I'm gonna end the stream, but like, man, that sucked. My best try at Bart Simpson. I mean, my voice is pretty thrown out right now, so it's gonna sound terrible, but uh, hey man, I don't know, that's my closest. He's just like a, a little shitty guy. Cat Cowabunga. No, that's that just sounds like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Yeah. I could probably get in that range uh, if my voice wasn't so tired. But as it is right now, I'm not going to be able to get, hit those highs. Oh, hey, we have a second viewer. Hey, second viewer. I have 49. I have 49 followers right now. If you follow, if you're not already following, if you follow my stream, you will be the 50th follower that gets me to affiliate, and I would really appreciate it. Yeah, I I know, it's not even close. I just haven't practiced at all. I'm not really an impressions person to begin with. I can do I can do kind of a George Takei. It's not it's not very good right now, but I, I can do a bit of a George Takei. Oh my! But uh, oh, a couple. Of, I do, I do. David Lynch. Uh, not a not a lot of people remember how David Lynch sounds, but I do. I do a David Lynch impression. 
Um, I, what, what was the one? Uh, I met with George Lucas, and we went to a restaurant, and it's not that I don't like salad, but they, they, all they served there was salad. Something that's kind of, that's kind of flip-flopping and other stuff. Um, what was, uh, J, J Bear Shell? I, I kind of do a decent J Bear Shell impression that such uh he plays hiccup in how to train your dragon i can't i can't do him being like excited at all or anything though i mean that one's that's that's just david lynch but you you, you kind of pull it down a little bit and make it a little younger a little less confident and they're just kind of the same thing bill cypher uh yeah kind of I wish, I wish I could do, well, actually I can, uh, what was the other one? I used to do the, Seuss, Seuss from Gravity Falls, friggin, uh, hey Doge, that's it, that's the only part I can do, as soon as I try and do other lines it falls apart, but the, I can do the, hey Doge, I can do that part. <laughs> uh, what other character, I can do, like, some of the Aaron Hansen ones, the, the Grubber. I, I, I fall into the grubber quite often. And the Pee-Wee Deity is very similar. <laughs> those, those ones are also kind of difficult to do with a tired voice. Although sometimes a tired voice will help out a little bit. Uh, there's... There's, uh... Is it Bob De Niro? This is my, cl this is my closest Robert De Niro impression. Yeah, I, I, I don't really work on it very heavily, but Bob De, you, the, the mouth kind of goes when you start doing the Bob De Niro. It's, it's, he's, he's got a good frown to his face. He got, he's always got that frown going on. Oh, boy. Well, I appreciate you encouraging me to, to go outside my comfort zone with that one. It's I, I need to... That's the big thing I need to do on stream more is I oh, I never want to go outside my comfort zone and like actually do voice work because I'm very self-conscious about it and I always like do a ton of takes before I'm really happy with something. But uh Yeah. I appreciate that. I want to do that more. That's why I want to do more stuff like Pokémon that has like voice lines and stuff to read. All right, with that, you can probably hear uh, from that in my, in my voice, I, I need some sleep, I need some rest for my voice and for the rest of me, so, uh, I'm not gonna do my whole spiel signing off, just thank you very much for watching, check out all my different links down below on the browser version, please consider following, it would help out a great deal, I just need that one more, one more follow to get to affiliate, and then I can just work on the average. Um, and, yeah. If no one else has told you, I'll tell you. You're a good kid. Goodbye, goodbye. Join me on Saturday in the afternoon for some, for some Oath again. It's very fun, very fun game. Goodbye. Oh, that's right. All of my shortcuts don't work in Streamlabs for some reason. Uh, hold on. Or actually, I'm going to raid you guys over, so let me figure out who I'm going to raid you over to. Uh, I'm, I'll, I'll take this off. You can still hear me, though. Yeah, all my shortcuts don't work for some reason, which is, for that reason alone, I might switch over. Uh, let's see. Where's the one? Where's the one? Uh, Twitch. Twitch. Who is streaming currently? Tony Bennett, none, oh, wow, a lot of people. Uh, Alan, let's, let's, uh, let's raid over to Alan. So, yeah, this, this is my friend, got it, this is my friend, Alan that I'm raiding you over to, he's playing Sea of Thieves. What the So, I hope you enjoy some pirate goodness. Alright. 
have a good night, everybody.